looks good. Thanks for watching the Teach Card Drive channel. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Fresh, healthy. And while we're eating non healthy chips right now. But also delicious. I guess like Greek souvlaki chicken kind of thing. Mm -hmm. With fresh lemons. And by the way, this isn't this kind of for you without mustard. It's fine. <laughs> That's what the chefs use on the, the cooking shows, right? And I, although I don't see them licking the lemon juice, but that's fine. <laughs> so what's in here so far? Lemon juice. Vitamin C. Ooh, the good stuff. Mm. Good stuff, good stuff. So we put a couple lemons, some olive oil. Oh, this is for the marinade, right? Mm-hmm. Salt and pepper. Yeah. This is the chef, AKA mommy. Although I like to be a chef, but apparently I'm on the messy side, so mommy does most of the cooking. <laughs> Try to have fun when we're cooking. Let's see. Close up. Hold on. That's a good amount. This stuff is strong, guys. I love the drop. Oof. It's not spicy at all. <laughs> you all right? We need the good stuff. Bobby Flay recommends. I was just gonna say, I'll do all the dill. Oh yes, the more dill, the better. I put it on the shelf for him. Hey guys, this is Tippy. She's circling like a shark because we have been basically chumming the kitchen. So to speak, she knows that later on, We're some of. Oh yeah, Tippy. <laughs> this is a nice little trick mommy came up with, mm -hmm. so that gets the garlic all real fine. Super garlicky. Garlic's good for you too. Yeah. Right, so? My grandfather, little daddy Tibbet, used to eat a whole garlic clove every single day. And I still do that sometimes because it reminds me of that. Man, look at that, that's cool. Ooh, I wish you guys had a smell -orific camera smell sensor. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, so, so far we put in yogurt and some green dill, dill and some and the best. The, and the brand is just called Oil Boy. What's that? And the brand is just called Oil Boy. So just call it that. What's it called? Oil Boy. Oh. So just call it that. I don't know how to say Oil Boy. Let's see the end result. Okay, hey, what did mommy just put in there, Zoe? I think it's mixing time. You want to show them your mixing covered. skills? Yes. There's onions and tomatoes. These are for the sandwiches. So we started the cooking process. Hey, Zell, come here. Looks good, huh? So the great thing about this is we also make some fries. That go in the sandwich. Yeah, because that's how they do it authentic Greek street food. Right, Zoe? And Zoe will have some probably 
just with ketchup, I bet. Ooh, it's a look at the size of this one. Is this the biggest one you've ever seen? Yeah. Okay, so we have to let the chicken cook for a little bit. Oh, it's going now. It's going now. So when it's almost done, all the juices are gonna go all back into the so we can brown it. That comes to browning time, Mommy said. An authentic Sandwich. street Greek street. Oh, I need to feed the bread first. That would be helpful. Uh -huh. All right. First, you take like this. That's how they do in the cooking shows. See? Then, a couple French fries. Then some chicken. All food safety standards have been followed while making this meal. A little bit of lettuce, tomato. As they say in the cooking shows, what? Hold on, I just need to go down my stairs. <laughs> and then a little bit of, as they say in the cooking shows, a little bit of onion, Cajun style. Did they say that in the cooking shows? It was used to be on Merlogazzi on TV, they did. Like this, see? You want it just like they do it like that. And then, you go like this. Ooh, looks good. Thanks for watching the Subscribe to our channel. I know it looks so nice. Oh my goodness. <laughs>